YouTube. Hello, and welcome back to Alan Wake 2. In the last episode, we did uh, Return 7, or initia Initiation 9, Return 7, right? We did Initiation 9, Gone, and Return 7, uh, the summoning, or summoning, just summoning. So, we'll now be doing, I think, Return 8? I don't know what's going on. Subscribe to the channel if you want to stay up to date with Alan Wake 2 content. Like this video if you like this video. And uh, comments for commenting stuff. to get to our next gig. We're doing this for you and our lovely saga. You take care of things on this side. Don't screw it up, Tom! I'd seen it all play out, like a horror movie I'd been forced to watch. The Dark Presence held all the cards now. So wait, are they going into the... Yep. I'm in Saga. Are in the dark place. And I'm here in this sick Kalavala Knight's leather jacket. Hell yeah. I have nothing. <gasps> oh, shoebox. Oh, the shoebox is gone. No. The Dark Presence is in Casey. Casey is Scratch. Stavest? Welcome back, Wake. You are Wake now, right? With the shadow out of you? Some good news, at least. Bad news is, I, I have haven't this. seen a situation this fucked since the AWE in Eagle River. The shadow's now in Alex, and Anderson is gone. We need to figure out how to salvage this. I'll do anything it takes to fix this, Agent Estevez. I'm the reason this is all happening. It's never that simple. But I should have put you in a box and shipped you off to a containment facility the second I laid eyes on you. The only question now is... Are you able to fix this? I can try. Maybe? Not the most encouraging answer, but we'll make it work. Scratch. The dark presence inside Casey. It threw Saga into the lake. If she ends up in the dark place, she could be there forever. It took me 13 years to get out. Zane never did. Tor and Odin went in after her, right? Maybe they'll get her out. With the power of rock and roll. I saw them when I was trapped there. They performed in my musical. I'm immediately less optimistic about this. <laughs> What's the situation? I've never seen an entity break a bureau containment unit like that. And now the dark presence is occupying Agent Casey? When it attacked him in the woods, it must have been preparing for this. And now he has the clicker. Scratch will go to Bright Falls and use the clicker to bring about the horrific ending he wrote for Return. But I can still fix this. How? Scratch must have the manuscript. If I can read the ending, I can rewrite it. I need to go after him. Well, you won't get very far without these. This plan is a real Hail Mary wake. I wish I could help, but this is all on you. I got you every kind of weapon we have available. Don't fuck it up. I needed a car. The FBI vehicle would be at the parking lot. Hell yeah. Alright. <clears throat> so now we just need to head to the parking lot, right? Assume these are all looted. This is all the stuff I'm gonna get, huh? Okay. Well... 
what do we have to work with? We have a double barrel shotgun, a revolver, and a flare gun. Not terrible. We have... Alan, wait, do you need to heal? We have four flare gun flares, three batteries, 10 shotgun shells, and 16 revolver rounds. I can't even see the fucking map. I was awake again, clear-headed for the first time in what felt like a lifetime. I was back exactly where I left. A dark forest outside Bright Falls. A gun in one hand, a flashlight in the other. Haunted by my own writing. Alice taken from me. I knew what I had to do. Stop the horror story from coming true. Stop the dark presence. Hell yeah. I totally remember the way back. <laughs> Fuck you. Do, 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 do. scared the shit out of me. Oh. <clears throat> We're fine. Everything's fine. Just go this way. So many taken. It's in here. Ooh. More flares, more pistol rounds. A lot more flares. Holy shit. Flare gun, kind of OP. Are we at the murder site? We are. Oh. Oh. Thank you. Why are there so many of you? Uh, uh, uh. Fucking Christ.
Oh. I actually thought that would work. I really thought that would work. In the dark place, the dark presence went into me. When I was pulled back here, crossing over weakened it, made it dormant. I couldn't remember what had happened, but I could feel it, getting stronger, waking up. I thought it was hunting me, closing in. It was inside me the whole time, and then it took over. Turned me into scratch. You think? No. I think the parking lot's right past this gate, right? I am mistaken? Oh wait, that's the parking lot right there. Yeah, there's the car. I had to get to Bright Falls. <laughs> See this through to the end. Did the fucking car. I brought Saga Anderson into this story to help me escape. She succeeded. It cost her everything. I'd used Alex Casey in my writing for years. The real Casey had been drawn here because of that. Now he was a victim too. Saga, Casey, Alice, all this horror originates from me. It's my fault. Scratch had to be stopped. I've driven down this road before. Been driving on it forever. If Scratch had brought the dark place here, this would take me back inside. In 2010, I had dived in. A leap of faith. For Alice, with no idea that the cost would be a nightmare worse than death. It had taken me 13 years to get out. Now Alice was dead because of me. And I was going to make that leap again, this time knowing the cost all too well. the dark place here with me I never had gotten out maybe after this I finally could it was a fool's hope I had no choice I had to do it that didn't make me any less terrified Turn eight, dear fest. I. This is not what I expected. Don't like this. Alan Wake is this generation's greatest storyteller. Koskala and welcome to the Koskala Brothers Book Club. This week we will review the highly anticipated new novel by Alan Wake, Return. Return is printed on a firm, high quality white offset, uncoated paper stock, making every page a true delight to turn in your fingertips. 
Alan Wake's brilliance is on full display with his choice of a hardcover book jacket made of a premium enamel stock with gloss lamination that is both tasteful and pleasant to the touch. Isn't that money? Wake set a high standard with his previous novel, but I can say without hesitation that Return contains the best and most compelling book description on a back cover that I have ever read. This book blurb is truly riveting and will keep you on the edge of your seat from start to finish. It is accompanied by a tasteful photograph of Alan Wake home here in Bright Falls. The book weighs one pound and three ounces. Return is a true masterpiece. I'll give it a perfect score of five Alma beers out of five. How about you? This is Chaka's not there. There you have it. Alan Wake has done it again. This was the Coscola Brothers book club. Was really fucking sad. I needed to get a copy of Return. I needed to read the ending to have a shot at changing it. It was really sad. I was inside Scratch's ending, a perverse version of reality. The townspeople brainwashed. Everyone and everything revolved around Return, as if it had just been published. Turn is sold out. That seems bad. Hmm. God, this is so strange. Oh, gods of Asgard are back. Why is he still in a towel? Sequel to Departure and Initiation, of course. Hi. Okay. Just gonna I could see the round windows of the writer's room in the photo. That's where I had to go to rewrite the ending of return. It's a thick, thick story, and I love it. Room to stop this horror story. Would have liked some time to exp explore the lodge, maybe. This was an obsessive, egocentric nightmare, all revolving around a vain monster of a writer and his final divine work of art. The novel returned come true. It wouldn't stop here, it would keep spreading.
Well, the writer's room's at the Valhalla nursing home. Oh. I don't have anything. I had to find another way inside. Okay. I guess this is close. Yeah. Um. Can go in over here, right? My wife. What was that? Alice was dead. Was this a trap? Or was Scratch torturing me? It's my wife. Wait, where the fuck are you? This way. The fuck do I do? Mm. The fuck do I do here? He's very pushy. Rose, right? From the diner. How are you here? <laughs> I'm here to save you, silly. I got your instructions. I found every hidden message you left for me. In the radio, in the wind, in the forums on my Alan Wake fan site. What? No, Rose, I haven't been leaving you any messages. Oh, I get it. Yes, Alan, only a crazy person would think you've been leaving them secret messages. <laughs> Wink. But now you need to get your butt upstairs, Alan. This shit won't write itself, no matter what William Shakespeare said. Right. Thank you, Rose. I'll do what I can. Okay. Upstairs, the writer's room must be in the attic. It is where the windows were on the third floor. Yeah, I know where it is. We'll loop around and come to Keter. Party. I have put everything ready for the visitors. I'll come to wash the floor of your room next. All you need is water. And Phileda. Water is the oldest pulp. Water finds its way. What water brings, it takes away. It can be clean or dirty. It can give life or drown it actively. I didn't expect to see you here, but it makes sense. 
Can you help me find my way? One last time. Mm, now there's a devil in the fist trap. Don't be spooked by it so that shit won't start beating your underpants. <laughs> Thanks, Adi. Okay. I'll get the door open for you, Tom. There you go. The matter is a stake. Now comes the end of the line. Thank you, Ahti. I was here. I needed to write the ending. I only had one chance to get this right. I needed an ending that took everything already in return and extended it into a conclusion that would save us. Only the perfect ending would work. The end, Eternal Deer Fest. The novel return come true, my final divine work of art. First granted to the people of Bright Falls, and over time it would spread, this celebration reaching everyone. Oh, right, I don't have a... Uh... to write a plot the point ending was an eternal deer fest that would keep spreading given time scratch would plunge the world into his nightmare i had to stop that from happening i had to write one more chapter for return a perfect ending that would save us all i was the only one who could write it everything depended on this on me any second now scratch would burst through that door to stop me every plot thread dangled in my brain it suddenly felt impossible. Something stirred in the room, coming to me. An idea. Oh, an echo. The ending has to fit the genre if it's going to work. In a horror story, there's only victims and monsters. If there is a hero, they will ultimately pay a heavy price. I won't let the horror stories stay broken and twisted. They were dragged into this. They need to survive. Non-negotiable. Not just them. We need to try to save everyone. The ending will have to be dark no matter what. The more people we save, the greater the cost. And the hero must pay the price. The scales always need to balance. Pay the price. The dark horror ending. To save them all, the hero must pay the price. Something felt different. I'd never seen myself in a vision before. But it fit. Saga and I were both at the center of this story. She was now my co-author. This was the beginning of the end. We were characters in a horror story, charging blindly towards the finale. We still didn't have everything we needed. This would not work without the clicker. <gasps> All right. That is going to do it for this episode of Alan Wake 2. I do believe, I could be wrong, but I do believe the next episode of Alan Wake 2 will be the conclusion to our story. So if you would like to be uh, notified of when that comes out, hit the subscribe button. Stay up to date on all the, the videos. We will be doing control after this for a little bit more layering into the, uh, the remedy verse, if you will. Uh, so, if you want to see that, you know, sub 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 uh, if you enjoyed this video, you can bing, 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 that little like button down there, a little do 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 uh, yeah, and, uh, comments for anything you want to talk about, uh, tell me, tell me things, ask me questions, just go down there and say not, I don't know, whatever you guys want to do, I'm very excited, I'm jumping directly into the finale. So, uh, yeah, until next time, YouTube, I love you. See you back here for more Alan Wake 2. Bye-bye.